Hey what's up YouTube and welcome back to the channel. Today I have some new tweaks to share with you guys. Those CD tweaks will be work if you are a D jailbreak with Electra Uncover or the Chimera jailbreak starting from iOS 11 up to 12.1.2. As always, before I'm gonna be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a tweaks video. Let me go ahead and start with the first CD tweak that I have for you guys and the first one is the simple LS2. This tweak has been updated if you already familiar and you know about that tweak from a long time ago. So this is the new design of that tweak, how it's gonna be it looks like. Even if you want to go ahead right now and jump under the settings of the simple LS2, you can see right now here that go ahead first of all and enable the tweak we have two different kind of design of that time in your lock screen also we have the clock view here if you go ahead and tap on it that will be giving you the text color here uh, which design that you're gonna be used for me in my opinion the dynamic style is gonna be perfect for the lock screen and then also we have the other some slider and toggles if you want to go through if I want to go ahead right now and just get back here and go through some other options here so we have a widget if you want to enable the uh, weather if you want to enable the weather with the time you will be able to do that also we have a widget option here if you want to go through and also we have some other stuff one of the stuff it's always on the disable here so you can take a look if you want to choose the OLED uh, on the display you can enable that adjust the slider how fast the time it will be show up in your live screen you can choose that from there or if you want to choose the always on display so this is the pretty much how is the uh, tweak work and most of the stuff from under the setting. Once again, if you're looking to download this one, this one is called Simple LS2. The next tweak, I will be talking about the Firefly. So you can take a look right now on my springboard that most the icons or the apps that I have and receive notification on it, it's kind of like a glowing. You can take a look on my Facebook, the YouTube, and my Twitter right now, and even some other stuff that you can take a look at it right now. So the name for this one, as I told you guys, is the Firefly. Anyway, so if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings here, go ahead and enable the tweak, custom color, so you can choose your favorite color, go ahead and tap on the color, just like that, and you can choose your favorite color from it there, and then also how much you want that color will be glowing using the slider here. Also, we have some other options in toggles here. You can choose those from there. You can choose to enable, disable, showing some stuff, showing the badges, all the folders, all that kind of stuff. You can configure from there. Once you're done, just make sure to resuperate your device and your device once you use that week it will be just showing the glowing just like that anyway this one is going to be called the firefly and moving right now to talking about the next CD tweaks and if you guys want to bring the iOS 13 volume hood into your device and I'm talking about this one right there which is a bring a iOS 13 style in your jailbroken device this is the 13 hood so this is how it's gonna be the hood will be pop up in your device as I told you guys this is the iOS 13 style talking about the settings there is nothing to configure the only thing that you need to do to just uh, enable the tweak and the volume will be work in your device just like that so once again this one is going to be called the 13 hood let me go ahead right now and talking about the most setup that I have right now on my settings. So I use more than a tweak. First of all, I use the shovel 
to set up the tweaks and the apps and separate all of those if you're familiar you already know about it and the next one out that i'm going to be talking about it right now which is going to be the vibrancy so let me talk on it right now here and this is the most of the settings that I have right now. So go ahead, first of all, enable the tweak under the options section here. Go ahead and enable the application. So the tweak basically will be use your uh, wallpaper and just blur that and you can take a look at it. It is really beautiful. Talking again about the apps, you so you can choose the apps from there. So we have the phone, you can use it for the phone, for the messages, and then even for your contacts here. You have the light and the dark mode. You can take a look right now that I choose already the dark mode. Also, we have if you want uh, to use the same style, you can toggle the DAC, the widget, the notification, the home bar as well as the folder background so i already toggled the folder background it is really beautiful if i launch one of the folders here you can take a look in my opinion it's going to be really beautiful as i show you guys this one is going to be bring nice and a beautiful style into your settings especially with the shovel and some other stuff which is in my opinion is going to be really beautiful with all that blur anyway this one is going to be cool once again vibrancy and let's go ahead right now to jump to talking about what kind of widget that i use right now on my device what kind of setup so this one is going to be the ew widget pack 20. so the source will be in the description go ahead and add the source you can find the pack go ahead and download the pack first of all the one that i use right now on my spring war and the other one that I have right now on my lock screen. So this is the both. And as I told you guys, uh, the source will be in the description. Go ahead and add the source. You will be find the pack. Once you find the pack, go ahead and go ahead and use the X and HTML in order to place those widgets in your Supreme board or in your live screen. That's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you liked the video, please once again, give the video a big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a tweaks video. Catch you with the next one. Peace out.